Welcome to Science, Health and Healing Library of Children's Health Corps. I'm Dr. Majid Ali. The subject of this article is do not rely on A1C test for diabetes diagnosis. Please do not rely on A1C test for diabetes diagnosis. Please. A1C test, the other name is glycated hemoglobin or glycosylated hemoglobin or simple hemoglobin A1C. Hemoglobin is a protein which carries oxygen in the blood. The higher the blood sugar level, the more sugar sticks to the hemoglobin and the level rises. The normal value should be 5.5% or less. People often mistakenly use this test to rule out the presence of diabetes, which in my judgment is a huge mistake. I'll give you a specific case to illustrate my main point. I think the only acceptable test for the diagnosis of diabetes is insulin, and this part is, this program is a part of a very large series, over 75 programs devoted to the subject of obesity, insulin toxicity, pre-diabetes, diabetes, the so-called metabolic syndrome. This 71-year-old woman came to see me because her doctor had told her that she has diabetes because her A1C value was 6.2%. As I said, the normal value should be 5.5% or less. She's a tall, thin woman. I'll give you the insulin profiles. On May 11th of 2010, her fasting insulin was less than 2, 1 hour 37, 2 hours 23, 3 hours 9, 4 hours 2. This would be considered a, an insulin profile, a good insulin profile. Indeed, for her, this is very close to the ideal. Her blood sugar was fasting 80, 1 hour 108, 2 hours 103, 3 hours 74, 4 hours 61. Again, anybody would call it normal glucose profile. Now, we repeated this test two years later on May 16th of 2012 when her A1C test had dropped from 6.2 to 6%, but still clearly abnormal. Her insulin level fasting less than 2, 1 hour 42, 3 hours 19, 4 hour 9. Her blood sugar was fasting 90, 1 hour 124, 2 hours 99, 3 hours 73. My point is these are very good insulin profile, excellent glucose profile. There is no reason why this woman should have been told that you have diabetes. Now I have a very large number of cases where A1C test is very misleading. The glucose tolerance is very misleading. Please watch another program entitled, Say No to Fasting Blood Glucose, Please. These are important issues. Insulin toxicity precedes the diagnosis of diabetes, 5, 10, sometimes 15 years in which it can be diabetes can be prevented and indeed it can be reversed in type 2 cases, in most cases, for up to 5, 10 years. So the stakes are high, you need to understand this. Children's Health Corps was funded and founded by Talat, my wife and myself, with a vision to provide authentic information about nutrition, environments and stress for children, their parents, their grandparents, their teachers. Please forward this YouTube segment to your email, Facebook, Twitter, LinkedIn contacts. Visit our website, www.kids123.org. That is K-I-D-S-123.org. Tell us how you can volunteer your energy and commitment to this worthy cause of disseminating authentic information untainted by corporate distortions as well as by ideological transgressions. Join us please. Thank you. Thank you so much.